New at 10, a brand new elementary school in Athens welcomed the community for the first time today. Students did begin their winter semester in the building on January 4th, but today was many families' first time seeing their student school. Way 31's Matt Pasquick gives us a look inside the new state-of-the-art facility. Well, a little over a year since breaking ground, the I Academy at Athens Elementary opened its doors today for the very first time to the public. And staff at the school tell me this has been a long time coming. We absolutely needed this. The old building um, at the, this same site uh, was very old, decades old, and had fallen into some disrepair. It was a celebration of sorts for members of the Athens community. <laughs> Students, their families, and staff all came together to celebrate the opening of the I Academy at Athens Elementary. Oh, I'm so excited to welcome our community into our building for the first time. So it's been exciting to see the reaction for people as they first came into the building today. The new school is 68,000 square feet and able to accommodate up to 600 students. It has 24 classrooms, a media center, an innovation lab, and a renovated gym. It's for the children and I'm glad that they're happy here. When I see their faces and they're smiling and they're running around, and they speak to each other, they take care of each other. It's home away from home. Regina Montgomery, known to her students as Coach Princess, said the new building has allowed her relationships with students to grow. When I'm standing there monitoring everyone after giving instructions, before I know it, I have a kid wrapped around my waist telling me that, I, that they love me, and, <laughs> and that's a beautiful feeling. And school principal Amanda Tedford said she can't wait for the future of this school. I cannot wait for generations of kids to come um, be a part of this. I love that so many of our faculty members went to school here and their families have gone through here and now they're here and just the, the future generations that will be able to enjoy this facility and so much learning that will take place. And almost a month after opening to students, staff told me today they are just grateful the building is finally open so children here in Athens can continue to learn for years to come. Reporting in Athens, I'm Matt Pasquitz, Wait 31 News.